In this video, we're going to be talking about removing distractions within a photo. The obvious goal for a photographer is to try to get everything as accurate in the camera as possible without distractions, but inevitably, you're going to need some software sometimes when that just isn't possible. Enhance has a couple different tools to remove distractions, and the first one that we're going to talk about is the Perfect Eraser. Just like the other brushes that we have within Enhance, a quick tip to change the brush size is to use the bracket keys to make the brush size smaller and larger as needed. You can also go up and change the size with the slider for the brush size slider up above. Once you have the desired size, you simply just paint on whatever it is that you want to remove. So here we'll take this light pole and we'll paint over that and then let go. And that item is easily erased. What we'll also do is we'll take this road sign and we'll paint over that as well as we want to remove that. We'll also take a look at the roof line over here and there's a bird that's on the roof line and I find that distracting so we'll remove that. And if there's a larger dust spot such as the one that we see over here, we can go ahead and click on that with the eraser tool. For dust spots and smaller items within the photograph, we can use the retouch brush for those. The last tool that we have in this enhanced toolbox for distractions is the red eye tool. Now, that doesn't make sense to use this here because this isn't a portrait, but when you get that red eye from using a flash with a camera, this is going to help remove that, and it's going to work just in the same way as we did with the eraser and the retouch brush, where you just paint that in where you want that removed, and it will automatically take the red eye out. 